So today we are in Pennsylvania and we're visiting Hershey Park. I'm excited. So let's get inside. Up next, the left track. Some of these rides, I do not know what they are, but we'll see. So, just got off of Wildcats Revenge and just got off of Laugh Track. Uh, Wildcats Revenge is a really good RMC. I guess you could say it's like the small, the small tier, but it really packs a punch, has a lot of airtime. And then Laugh Track, it was just an indoor roller coaster. We're very light, We're very light on the theming. Still a good time. Now we're going to go on to Lightning Racer. So we just got off a uh, Lightning Racer. I did the Thunder and Lightning sides. Um, it's very cool because they make sure that each time they run it that it duels so it's a good aspect it's a little bit rough it is a wooden coaster not all wooden coasters are rough but that one's a little bit more rough than it needed to be but nonetheless it was still a fun ride let's see what we could get into next so it looks like right here they have a ride called tidal force doesn't look like it's been running for a while Just got off a ride on Fahrenheit, and that ride really surprised me. The drop, pretty good, 97 degree drop. And then like one of the last like uh, airtime hills, it was like super good. Kind of dark there, but hope to get something to eat. Kind of starving. Perched atop, 
Hershey Park supports Milton Hershey School in its mission of helping students lead fulfilling and productive. So included in your admission, they have a zoo that you can enter as part of your Hershey Park admission. I think that's pretty cool. I'm not going to explore it today, but maybe next time in the future we'll explore that.
just got off a ride on Candemonium, as you can see in the background. And that thing is an airtime machine. I could at least count four times that I was literally lifted out of my seat. That's a must do when you come to Hershey Park. This is the final ride of the night on the Coco Cruiser. So that is going to do it here from Hershey Park. Uh, had an incredible day. So glad I got to visit this park finally. They have a really good collection of coasters. And if you're looking for somewhere new that you haven't visited, it's about, depending on traffic, about two hours from the Philadelphia airport. But it's definitely worth the shot. I know there are another couple theme parks that are in the Philadelphia, Pennsylvania area. So we'll see what we check out tomorrow. But with all that said, then we get to hit that like button and hit that follow. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.